Hello everyone, this is Hunter Collector here with another uh, Cyberpunk 2077 video. So, it's still loading. Still loading. There we go. Now it's going up. All right. Soak in that sun while you can. There's a cold front moving in. Cold front. Hey V, Regina Jones here. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How'd you find me? How'd you even hey, know my name? Yo. I know where to gather my intel. How about you could even call me a collector. What do you say? How you like nice, my new nice. bag? Just gave me a next gen ass woman. <laughs> next gen ass woman. <laughs> so how about it? Nah, not today. Oh, Thanks shoot. I was trying you. to go up. Whatever. I'll be here. There we go. Let's now do we... this. Light on your feet. Keep that head moving. Come on. I beat him. Oh, uh, what you got on sale? What have you got for sale? Only top shelf gear. Top shelf gear? Oh. Just something about fighting. Mm. I've seen you land in blows in the ring. You've got sharp instinct, good edge. You can go far, especially if you get chipped. These fights, let's just say they aren't legal, but very lucrative. Yeah, lucrative for who? You or me? Both of us. I get a small percentage of the total winnings, you know, as your agent. You get the rest. Sounds fair. It's like I said. Good instinct. Fights happen in different parts of the city. You choose where you want to go. Put down your eddies and start swinging. You win, you take home the pot. Manage to drop every last one of them. You get a chance to fight in the grand finale. Huh. Are all clear? Crystal. Good. Oh, except you won't be setting foot outside or what? Not yet. Start in Kabuki. I believe in you, V. Time to show this city what you're made of. All right. Let me see what he's got in cell. Cars? All right, what are these? Alright. 
All right, a couple of words about your going up against. Uh, okay. and theatrical performances in the No tradition. The sponsor for the festival is the Arasaka Corporation, and in an exciting development, even Kanako Arasaka has announced her participation in the Dashi. Oh, that's fine. It's hot today. Copper? <gasps> Don't want to push paper. Little kid. You got a big dumb face. <laughs> nah, I got a big dumb face. What's in there? Chill. It's over here. Hey, bud. Man of the hour. <laughs> Jeez. Took you long enough. Worked up an appetite. Just waiting. Sit down. Let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. Mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right or just mm -hmm. had a brain fart? Probably both. Because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens. I think I might have bagged us a sweet ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but just that he's fronted by a little known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold plated coup. Who? So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh, his whole deal Half function, right but... on you now, I see. I was gonna say right. what? Right Let's hear what old Dex has to say. Set it up. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but <laughs> Dex is in a league of his own. You know what I'm saying? Know my way around fixtures. Yeah. Not really, no. It's always the same story. You land on fresh turf, local fixer waves his dick around, but he's smiling, saying you'll be up to your neck in gigs and eddies. Still, all you are is another name in their little black book. Nifty tool for getting them a fat slice of whatever half baked shit pie their client put on the table. Sure, you crack jokes over drinks, but in the end, it's biz. All right. Gracias, Dios. Estoy lleno. Brought your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our uh, dust off with the scabs. Thanks, huh? Jack. Much appreciated. Some top notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. All right. Ooh. First stop. Oh, so I'm driving now. And Holmes, easy on the gas, huh? I just ate. All right, where am I going? I was supposed to stop by Vicks anyhow. I got a date. Me and Miss D. You don't say. She's so sweet. 
really gets me, you know. I'm not really good with the uh, first person. Oh wait, switch camera. There we go. Ah, dang it. Nice parking job. Yeah, this is it. Come on, V. Oh. Find me once Vic's done dusting your circuits. We'll hash out what Dex is cooked up. You are not the masters of your memories. For your eyes do not belong to you, or rather. Hey, V. Yeah, well. Doctor, we'll see you now. Do you truly believe that those were stolen? Hey, hey, well. I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little catching up to do. You look pleased. Cause I am. Always. Makes for easier living. But... Alright, you guess I go back there? We got a new job lined up. Alright. Oh, that's a cat. Is this fight? Vicky, surprise every old ripper. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, V. Oh, wow. What do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Old kit and caboodle. All right, kid. What? We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Need tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit oh, crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time, you hear? All right, you gotta fix me up. Sure, please. Sit down and relax. Kuroshi optics, best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. So you're popping out my eye and putting that one in? Now jack in. You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. Oh. That's cool. We're just so small and there's a lot. I can't really read that, but then. Put that in. Or do I have to buy it? Oh. Okay. What's over here? Hands. Mark one, like I said, decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. But just remember, huh. your body will still show up as crystal clear. 
Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. Kuroshi Tech. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. All right. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic, and I can start cutting. Can't come arm off or something? Feel anything? Her hand? Feels like I'm at the dentist. Play by play, though? Really, Doc? Makes you sound like a dentist. Always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannick hand. Could slip. Hmm. <laughs> Lights out for a minute, all right? Oh. I can't see. I can't see. I'm blind. Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. Well. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Uh, better than ever. Seen more dramatic improvements before. Patience, kid. Give it a minute. Oh. See any people? Not. Time for the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's rarely the charm. <laughs> With anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. Huh. I also inject an NCPD file search. Ooh. When it's any ne'er do wells, <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. Database of wanted persons. Ah, huh? that's cool. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new site. New site. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. All right. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. I'm gonna call from Jackie. Or text, what's taking so long? Move your ass. Um, Dex is waiting for us. Okay. Chakra looks a little out of. I can release it for you, but you'd have you to watch there, out bud? for negative energy fields and avoid mean red. V, yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my. Well, duty calls. V, listen, I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now, that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me, for a few reasons. There are people who say cyberpsychosis huh. can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. All right, time to drive. Hmm. 
Oh. Sounds like someone's getting shot. Yo, Mr. V. A pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. What's going on? <laughs> Let's roll. Mind if I ask you something right off the bank? Would you rather live in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? Hmm. No, Mr. Nobody's don't survive. Let's see. They remember you, that's all. It's that first counts. place and no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager, supple youth. Respect. Hello? All right. Listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scab on. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip, to be precise. Job's to grab it. Simple. Yeah. Was he the dude that was trying before. to kill me mm -hmm. in the trailer? Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. Uh. No, no problem. Just a death sentence. NC's Arasaka's turf. Nobody fucks with them here. What can I say, Mr. V? High risk, high reward. First rule of the afterlife. Besides that, I'm no leadhead. Ain't gonna leave no trace for them to follow because we're gonna do this clean and on the hush hush. We understand each other. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second, a rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Ooh. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead. A little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single use toy. Now, huh. I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, a.k.a. Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shipstrom, one Meredith's doubt of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Who's the one? Prima Donna. Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be hmm. getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Klein, what's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End the convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, we'll be there for it all. All right. If yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person. Did you guys just run someone over? Some I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. Pretty sure this dude just ran someone over. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. All right.
Hmm. It's a steep hill that we're on. One more thing, Mr. B. Quiet life or a blaze of glory? Hmm? Hmm. Good question. But I'm guessing that's rhetorical. Later now. All right, bye, Felicia. Performing certain actions will reward your street cred. Jackster, talk to Dex. <laughs> Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nod, yeah. Food vendor. Clint to want to check our pro cred. But to me, it feels more like he tangled us up with Maelstrom and Militech. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clepped it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. I right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but... I don't know how much help she stands to be. Huh. <laughs> Interesting. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Hmm? You mean me? I say we knock on Maelstrom's door first. Pound, actually. Orale. In that case, I'll hit the all foods, put my nose to the ground. Just around. Hasta luego. Hasta luego. Alright, so we're going over there. This place looks massive. Mr. V, I just want to remind you again that Eddie's have already changed hands between me and my esteemed Maelstrom um, partners in biz. A round sum of 10,000 credits to be precise. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Meet Jackie. Oh, that's not what I want to do. What the hell? Whoops. Oh. Nice. Supposed to go. Hey, why did you run me over, ass hat? Alright, I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Oh, yeah, I call. Um, uh, Militech? How do I call? Oh, there we go. There's the, there's the. Checkpoint. I'm coming, Jackie. I'm almost there. Uh, Sup, Jackie? There you are. Let me hear what you squared away. So Dex already paid the Maelstrom is for the Corporal bot. Thing is, can't be sure the gang goons are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? 
Well, whatever. Let's go get this tech. You scheme yet? You got a plan? That shit can go smoothly. This is Maelstrom. Gang world ain't too complicated. Might's right, the strong survive. Either you fuck others, or you get fucked. So, into the Borg Beast then. Let's go see these bastards. All right, let's knock on their door. See if they even open up. Am I driving or not? Oh, or are we, we just, just walking walk in? in? Okay. I hate these Borg fuckers. Just had to be them. Just a gang like any other, right? I'll take the Valentinos. They follow God and the Santa Madre. Honor means something to them. You know what they want, how they get it, and what pisses them the fuck off. With Maelstrom, huh. you just never know. Go on, let them know where. All right, so E9, so we need to do. Ah, uh, 55. E9. E9. Ah, uh, shoot, 55. Ah, shoot. But I don't know what I'm doing. What am I supposed to do? Ring a ding ding chum. Gotta get Oh, it's this. Okay. Don't know you. Wanna to talk to Royce. Dex sent us. Main room. We've been waiting. All right then. Whoa. Uh, cozy place. They could use a few plants though. Oh yeah. They look damn well prepared. Don't think I've ever seen security like this in a chow factory. Gear from the Jack Convoy, gotta be. Must have been all over it like maggots on dead meat. You hear about their boss, Royce? Dex mentioned him. Called him special. Anything else around? No? I can't see anything. There we go. What does mean us homes? Shit. Anti-personnel mine. Directional shrapnel spitter. My favorite. Subtle. Open up. New message. Oh, that's a lot to read. Don't test them. Don't provoke them. Don't. What if I want to provoke them? All right, you chill, V. Remember, we're on their turf. So what do you want? You got a bot, model MT zero D one two, called the Flathead. And the hell you care? Guy I represent already paid brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Nah, you talk to me. Name's Dum Dum. Your name's Dum Dum? Couch. Makes, Makes sense. sense. You look like a Dum Dum. Too. 
I'll stand. This oh. so fucking hard? Fucking ass on the fucking couch! Make me. Thought you'd never ask. Sit your ass down Jack, for Sit down. This ain't gonna end well, but. Shit. Well. Alright. Come on. Got lighten up. Take a hit. Mm, I'll pass. Thanks. I'm good. Whatever you say, straight edged princess. All right, is that the robot? Here we go. A flathead model MT zero D twelve. Need to see it. Sue yourself. Whoa. Fucking tricked out this thing. Dynamic thermal optic camo armor. Full Ooh. cognitive immersion with a Raven controller. Pimped out prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium Kevlar composite. And watch this. Fully integrated link too. So when the spider starts crawling up walls dangling from ceilings. Where'd you go? Mm -hmm. Could lose your lunch. Oh, there it is. What you think? We'll take, we'll take it. it. Yep, we'll take it. Free. Sure. Yeah. Let's see your cred. Brick got it. It's all paid up. Oh, shit. Brick got it. Huh. I don't see any fucking brick around here, do you? Come on. Can't expect me to pay for this thing twice. And who the fuck are you to say what can and can't be? You'll pay twice, because I say you'll pay twice. Well, I'm not paying twice. You want the flathead? I better see some eddies. Seeing as you already got the eddies for it, you ought to offer us a discount. A big one. A discount? Fuck. You know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Bryce. is Sean. That's who. Dexter Deshaun, the lord ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica. <laughs> he ain't dead. No, he's alive. Well, Where's my, my gun? gun again. He sends his regards. There we go. So you're gonna consider my offer now? I'll, I'll blow his head off. off. Bang! Bring it, right. suckers! Cabrons! What's that? Upgrading iconic. What the hell just happened? Oh, I just answered. What the hell? This dude won't die. Cut off. Gotcha. Button control Quick. It's 
production line. Plus, I thought you loved me. Open this up. Um, how did you get up there? Oh, I see. Oh, good. It's moving. Let's go. A bunch, a bunch of guys. guys. Are you just gonna shoot them out? See anything here? All right, which one is it? Uh, one C. BD I did Uh well short circuit Did they catch me? What the hell? Go, go, go! Ah, come on, stop with the photo mode stuff. No, no, stop, stop the, the photo mode stuff. stuff. Come on. I'm just running. Overheating. Get down, bud. Good job. I'm overheating from what?
turn off. How am I getting hit? Oh, oh what? what? I died. I died. Dang. That was getting so good. Somewhat. I got to stir all over completely. I thought you loved me. There's really no other way. <laughs> oh, good. Let's go. Oh, what, what the, the fuck, fuck did I just throw? Ladies and gentlemen! Uh, five, five, or yeah, there you go. Uh, one C, one C, one C, one C. There's no one C there, so I mean, I couldn't do anything. Short circuit. Go, go, go! Birded. Oh, you're shit now. Hey. 
All right, what else is there, Wes? Oh, oh shit. shit. Oh, oh shit. shit. Did I just, just kill myself, myself by blowing, blowing that thing up? up? Whoops. Darn. Anything else here? Okay, hat. Is that a gas mask? Shirt. That one has more armor, it looks like. Insufficient perks, okay. Ah, oh, nice. Oh, whoops. Uh, can I go back up? It's a production line. Plus, I thought you loved me. Really, no other way. Up we go, again. Alright, there we go. Off. Which 
protocol E9 1C E9 Nice Get in. I'll be your friend. I can't. I'll, I'll be, be your, your friend, friend too. too. I'm, I'm coming, coming down. down. Oh, what was that? The fuck? Oh, great. I mean, I'm getting hacked too. Not here. here. I, I swear, swear not. Shotgun. Guy over here. The light. I
He's almost dead. Got him. Alright, now we gotta clear our way up there. That's a lot, guys. Got him. Enough of the overheating crap. Flies in here. Right. Oh. I can't see anything. There we go. Too late.
I'm carrying too much what? I gotta remove some stuff from my inventory. Alright, let's see what I have to remove then. Ooh. It's blocked though. Let's see here. What does that say? Huh. How do I get rid of it? Oh, this man. Bunch of stuff in my inventory. I got a new hat, looks like. Oh god, no. New jacket. Um... Bag and upgrade. Reflexes, probably. Nice. Alright. We out of here. Come on, V. Let's get. No begging, no debt, no corpo strings attached, and the flathead's ours. <laughs> That's the way to do biz, V. Tough Couldn't agree more. more. Yeah, because I'm right. Always. Nice of you to notice. Ah. ah, I love this town. The city of endless opportunity. This. But if you got the cojones, and you know how to use them. <laughs> Whoa. Wait, what the? Unless you catch a bull, stray or not. Look how massive. That, that, wow. Wow. Look how massive this map is. Jesus. As insane. Wow. Even then, you go out with a bag, right? Wow, gotta take a piss. Even then, you go out with a bang, right? And the street'll talk. The street'll remember. So we win. What now, Jack? What now? Now I go back. Find Misty. We do something to make me feel alive again. They could have shot us up good back there. No two ways about it. Catch a fright back there, that you wouldn't make it back. <laughs> Shit like that don't cross my mind. Are you but sure I am about grateful that? for coming through. Don't forget to let Dex know we got his toy for him. Hey, Loewe. Jeez. How things looking, Mr. V? 
Got the bot. And how'd it go? Run into any trouble? And what about the Militech angle? Sure, of course there was trouble. Royce couldn't have given two shits that you and Brick had shaken on him. How'd you get him on board? You used the Corpo woman? Did it without Militech holding my hand. Didn't want to risk it. So how'd you get that cat Royce to hand over the flathead? Only way I know that always works. Brute force. You got some balls, Mr. B. What about the See, meet with Evelyn Parker? Still on the to-do list. Mm -hmm. That meet's the only thing that'll get you a chance at grabbing that chip. Parker will be waiting for you at Lizzie's bar. Good luck. All right. Go to Lizzie's. Understood. He's still hiding. First will come great reality. Uh, check which ushers and the future of the world. Oh, whoops. Big C. Don't go through there. Thanks, what, what the? the Nice, nice, nice. All right. Now I'm not gonna shoot you, chill. What the hell was that? Please. That's a big ass gun. All right, go to Lizzie's bar between six PM and six AM. Okay. What was what just happened? 
Huh? I just, I just tried, tried jumping, jumping over, over something. something. What? Okay then. Faster, okay. Oh, I just threw a grenade. That's not good. Oh, is that a bomb that I jumped over and this exploded? Huh. Looking a little put out there, input. Interest you in a preem BD? Sure. I didn't see what it said. It was blocked. Hold it. House rules first. There will be severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. No drugs, no groping. Someone catch your eye? You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. I really look that green to you. Like I don't know. Mm-hmm. Doors open. Have fun, input. Welcome to Lizzie's. So was it like a strip club or something? My, what a sweet little face you have. Had a feeling. I heard he dumped her already. Yeah, <laughs> no surprise there. Watch it. You're in my way. Hey. Get you something. Uh, yeah. I'm looking for Evelyn Parker. You know if she's here. Who's asking? Name's V. She and I have a uh, date. Well, V, it's a pleasure. I'm Mateo. Uh huh. So, Evelyn? Club's big. Gonna have to look around. Can't do it for you. Ah, right, okay. Mateo. He's waiting for this one. Yellow. Evelyn Parker. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Why not say hello sooner? I wanted to get a good look at you first. And, and like what you see? If I didn't, rest assured, you'd know. Hmm. Come on. No place we can talk where ears won't prick up to listen. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. Anyone asks, we're not here. So, what can a Nothing horny true. girl like really? do for Why don't you just tell me the truth? I just told Interesting. You. Oh, what on earth?
Yeah. The Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional, effective, and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. Uh, let's, let's just cut. Let's cheese. talk biz. I mean, it's nice, but I didn't come here to get my ego stroked. Hmm. No, you're here to gain some knowledge, the life-changing kind. Well, now you got me all excited. Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic. Secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka, making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? Uh, never had the opportunity. No, just never rolled through that neighborhood. Damn shame. The fresh they serve is sinfully good. Chef must have made a deal with the devil. So where's this chip hiding exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? He's in town? Don't you read the scream sheets? The media couldn't get enough of Yori coming to Night City. It was huh. all over the headlines. Anyway, he's heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son. What? So Arasaka Jr.'s planning to grab the reins while in Night City? Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Telling me you're one of them? Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your prick perk up. Yorinobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch. Aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device, because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now, where's he hiding it? Well, likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is... You'll see for yourself soon enough. All right. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. Okay, what's next? Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. I think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits. Jacking off to in those boxes. Like no, no, don't huh. cry. You it can be a very though. useful tool. Good for sure. analyzing sure. details, Please human go. perception, even boosted, doesn't grasp exactly what you need. So what's on the tape? Yorinobu's suite, the glorious interior. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Hold up. Mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? Supposed to be Yorinobu's pad on the tape. Means you were inside. You know each other? How else could I get all this intel? Huh. I know him pretty well, actually. We have an arrangement. Strictly business. Suits us both, I think. Let's see this brain dance. Judy will help. She's I'm a monster. Too. This one. Besides, we go back uh, years. V, this is important. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. I trust her. Of but course. she's a mox. You can not the latest me, member babe. of your crew. Try not to forget. So, mm -hmm. you'll be a good boy. Tread lightly. And keep that tongue on a leash. Relax. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. This is V. He's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. Gonna make me barf. Hey. Hey, Judy. Compiled your BDF. What do you think? Will it do? 
Still pretty raw, but yeah, ought to do. Mm-hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So, let's calibrate. Tune it to him. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. Should see the jig jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. Oh, jeez. So we drop V inside. Let him look, let him rummage around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip before? Think I can handle it. Let's just do this. All right. Righto. Sit down, settle in, and we'll get you going. Is this chair, chair sanitary? sanitary? Gotta create your sensory profile first. Okay. Hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. Not this now, time. Now sit still. Look at me. Gonna run the analysis soft. Should feel a slight tingling. Mm -hmm. Okay, now let's set the optics and other sensory sigs. Look smack into these two screens. Pretend it's an eye exam. Am I gonna have to do this calibration dance every time? Not necessarily, but it's worth the wait. Give me two more minutes and you'll see exactly what BD analysis is capable of. One more sec. Need to get the pain receptor limiters in. Okay, all set. You need to test your profile first. Tossing in a sample BD. You can use it to get to know the editor. Now let me see, where could we... Huh. Can't he just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So we don't risk our necks? Besides, won't take a sec. Got something here. Should be perfect. Boot it up. Alright. Let me give you the tailored version first. Let you get your bearings. Then we'll jump into editing mode. Be diving in in three, two, one. Wait. Alright, what are we doing? Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those cycle breaks from the studio. Got it, got it. <laughs> and remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. So am I watching the crime? Like I'm investigating? Want to see you kissing the flooring? Money now! Jesus! Fucking drop you! I swear to God! Whoa! Yeah! Hey! Now! Before I blow your fucking head off! Oh, you got shot. And being anything, anything is probably his partner. partner. Too much. Felt. I feel the guy's. 
pain, his stress, his hope. Hope wrapped up in something else. Mm-hmm. Probably took a booster just before. You'll be fine. Got everything set up? Let's switch over to editing mode. Editing mode now? I'll sever the link to the BD Roller's sensory array. You'll be able to look around freely. Full uh -huh. yours. Full cam control and analysis mode. So move around, zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sandbox. So analysis mode, you control playback. Can even pause when you feel the need. Then you use the editor console to unpause. Try it. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. Dream as hell, right? Well, that's not all. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. <laughs> Give it a try. Rewind. Roll it back to the top. Can I, can I? All good. Neat. Now try fast-forwarding a bit. Plan simple. Do nothing up. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash. Get out. And we see. Tell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Okay. You can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Now for some fun. This here's why you came in the first place. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan details of the enviro recorded by the BD roller. Huh. Focus on the heat. The gun this gonk gets from his buddy at the beginning. Now scan it. Scan it. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Okay, right here. Excellent. Let's move on. Now, heads up. In analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. Huh. This tech records everything. Every little detail. Even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, good. Now, you should see several sound signatures in the store. Choose one and hone in on it. Okay, fuck! On you ah, little shitheads! Go restock. I'll take the register. <laughs> How about you suck a bag of dicks, eh? Hey? So, any thoughts? Unbelievable. Seriously. Like what's happening right next to me. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sound, explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. Sometimes you can analyze extra layers in the raw. Stuff the roller's cyberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared. Meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. Huh. <laughs> Hella nice. Now let's wait till the guy punches out the gong at the counter. Alright. Down! Everybody! On the ground! I wanna see you kissing the flooring! Money! Scanning works on peeps, too. Walk up to the wounded chick. Try scanning her. Alright, next thing. Scroll forward to the part where our artist gets a lead injection. Wait, what? what? Now! Or I will fucking drop you! I swear to God! Whoa, yeah. uh, now! 
Before I blow your fucking head off! See that? They shot him and he never saw it coming. But you Who shot him? Here it comes. My favorite part of the game. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Surveillance cam. Must have caught our shooter. You'll see in a sec. Can't Probably just to the screen partner. The clerk. Roll back to where the screen's in the kid's field of vision, then scan it. Knew it. Must have got a nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. BD freaks are ready to pay a preem for a real flatline. Anyway, if you've seen enough, you can exit. All right. Interesting. Right? It's too bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the log. Anyway, you ready to do this? Look at your wreck? No way. Let's take a break. Still feel like that kid when. Oh, yeah. I think I'm done. V, there's no time. Get it together, please. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Just need T Bug to link in. Whoa, 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 who? Running for my crew, security specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we analyze. No problem, I hope. Actually, it is a problem. Oh. Not what we agreed, Ev. Judy, T-Bug's a professional, discreet to a fault. You can trust her. Why? Because you say so? Please, Judy. I'd never expose you to any danger. You know that. Call T-Bug and we'll dive in. Hey V, what's happening? Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Compeki Plaza. It's a brain dance. Compeki? Oh, thought as much. Someone there with you? Judy and Evelyn, they're chill. Yeah. They helped me work through this BD. Uh-huh. All right. You gonna tell me what this is about? Listen, need your help. Got no clue what to look for once I'm in. All right, see if I can walk you through it. Jacking it to your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my request now. Got it. You ready? A millisec. Okay. Connection confirmed. Now some quick tip ice, and we're clear. Ready to dance. Fire her up, Judy. All right. Fear. Sure got it under control quick, too. I said no. 
They'll have huh. my head for this. Then you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute. Listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. Your name Melina. Was Mark Foster? I said no. They'll have my head for this. Then you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to finish. Finish what? what? We shall see soon enough. My father is a tired, visionless old graybeard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny Inyatsa in her marrow feeling. Thinking about listening to this conversation that was happening in the room. I said, no. They'll have my head for this. Then you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to finish. We shall see soon enough. My father's a tired, visionless old graybeard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. What do you got? We'll listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we want now. In the audio scan. Noted. Okay, okay scan you should. Hung up. Go back to when they first start talking. Need to hear the whole thing. Alright. No. Oh. They'll have my head first. Then we shall pass with the company. Once again, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute finish. Alright. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father's a tired, visionless old graybeard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. You will listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. Well, I am good. quite sure we want now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must Not provide it. them. In Heard that? Relic docks gotta be around here somewhere. Look for them. This, this must, must be the audio, audio from, from way back over here. here. Here in a drone. Ventilation and cooling? Servers. Gotta be. Fancy doodads in here need to be controlled. Dazzies. We shall see soon enough. I said, no. They'll have my head for this. Then you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to finish. The program is still. The trial phase. We cannot take it to market as All right, what's next? Visual layer. Please speak with your father. She is. 
dead and Hodge and Cloud is turning. My father's a tired, visualist old greybeard who thinks nothing will change. Oh, I saw something in this game. He'll live forever in his tiny, frozen dwarf, frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. You will listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that we never We have no seen I do have you. What you we have to do? Storage conditions. We must no, have no. Sorry to make you wait. Here, wait. Business. Can't be stupid. It wasn't long. Not even long enough for me to grow bored. Is everything all right? He's intense. Edgy. A moment. It will pass. Hmm. I can get to work on that. Just one condition. You wish to make demands of me. Only one. Focus on me. Oh, got any candy left? Stuff was pretty fun last time. Bedroom. Nightstand. I've got an idea. Be right back. Very nice, but come here already. Just a sec. Looking for the perfect thing. Ah, you'll like this. Oh, go, go back. back. What's that? that? Manual details of special tip controlled container. Relic needs to be kept real cool. This guy so, gun. Chip's gotta stay in the freezer. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Should be easier to spot where you are know who's keeping the chip. It's probably, probably here. <laughs> oh, Donaghy's. Looks like Mr. Arasaka had something to celebrate. Really think you'll find the chip in there? No way. Tint's too low. Could fluctuate. Nice try, though. Nothing over here. Never have existed. I've got an idea. Be right back. Nice. 
night, but come here. Weapon. Weapon. Scan the thermal clues so you can find relics. Relics. So right over here. Fast forward. Nice. I've got an idea. Are you down to that? Come back. Come back. the guidelines. Won't find a thing here. Go over there, get back over there. Who's got the case here? Guaranteed. Mm-hmm. We got it. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Quit out of the editor. All right. That took a little bit longer than I expected it to. All right. Need? Yep, that'll do. Thanks, Judy. We got it. Later, T Bug. Nice work today. See you soon. I'll wipe the cash on your data. You were never here. All right. All right. Keep it. I'll put it on Ev's tab. I Portable device it. for handling BDs. I already uploaded your calibration settings. 
Oh, nice. nice. And it keeps you out of harm's way. Clever. Speaking of harm's way, know what I see looking at you? Walking, talking corpses. We needed that recording, Judy. The BD practically does our job for us. The BD will be the death of us. Seriously. If Arasaka finds out you have it, you're dead. I'm dead. Judy, relax. Finish and be. Evelyn, please. No shortcuts. You go that route, city will always win. So be careful. Of course I will be. Besides, Psych. I'm talking a bit. All right. All right. All right, I'm gonna leave it at that. that.